sausage pepper pasta. <laughs> so, so sausage pepper pasta is a favorite in our house. Um, there are some different substitutions that you can make if you don't have all of these things in your pantry. Uh, but for us, we're going to start with one pound of pasta. It doesn't matter what shape this is or what kind. I like buying the protein pasta because it gives us extra protein. Also, it doesn't matter if you put peppers in your pasta or not. You can have it without pot, without without these peppers. Without right. peppers or with peppers. Either yes. way, it's still going to be pasta. We had a couple of peppers in our refrigerator, so we're going to use these up. Um, but again, you don't have to put the peppers in. They just give it to give some veggies to our to our pasta. Well, we're also going to cut up an, about a half of an onion Wait, and put that what? in there. You put onions in it? Yeah, can't even tell, they cook down. You also need a can of spaghetti sauce. I'm just using a can of ragu for this. And you need a pound of sausage. I use Bob Evans, just original sausage. If Again, you, it doesn't matter what type of sausage, it just matters that there's sausage. Right, or if you don't have sausage, you, you could use hamburger for this as well. That would be fine. Yeah, I mean, but you like, you like the sausage in it. Yeah. Okay, so what you're gonna, going to want to do is get a pot of water boiling while you're, while you're cooking your sausage. So that's what I'm gonna do, the, the water is on. I'm going to squeeze in the sausage into our pan. This was a two pound package and we actually had this a few days ago. So we're making it again with the rest of the sausage. This is actually something that every single person in our house eats. Yeah. Crazy. Okay, so I'm going to wash my hands. Get out, we'll get out a wooden spoon. Mama, do you have sausage? Okay, so you're going to get out a wooden spoon and you're just going to chop up this sausage in your pan. We are going to fully brown this sausage before we do anything else. While this is browning, you're going to want to cut up your veggies. Okay, so we'll let that cook a little bit while I cook, cut up some veggies. Um, an easy way to cut your peppers, if you just slice it in half, and then you can scoop out the, the stem part. If you're nervous about using the knife, that's a pretty easy way to get it out. The top part just pulls right off. Okay, and you'll want to take out all of your seeds Wait, there are seeds in those? Right. Wow. There's seeds in anything that grows. Okay, so we're going to cut our pepper into strips like this. They look like french fries. Yeah. Yep, and then you're going to cube them so they're a little bit smaller. Okay? Now they look like nothing. Okay. Alright, so we're going to continue chopping up our peppers, browning up our hamburger or sausage, and we will be right back. All right, so our sausage has finished browning, and I've chopped up our peppers. The next step is to take a bowl or a plate and put some paper towel in that, and then you're going to scoop out your sausage into that bowl. Can I put the peppers in? Yep. Okay, so we what we're doing here is draining the grease off of the sausage, and then we're just going to use a little bit of the excess grease in the pan to help saute our peppers and our onions. Okay, and meanwhile, our water has just started to boil as well. So, we're gonna set that aside and let the grease kind of drain out in that bowl. We're going to add our pasta to our boiling water. Add that in, give it a quick stir, and then that should be good to boil for about eight or nine minutes or so, depending on what type of pasta you're using. Turn it down just a little bit. Okay, you want to add the peppers? Okay, take, let's take this spoon and scoop them in. Can you do that? It's a big spoon. So where do I drop it? Scoop it, yep, right in there. So dry these? You're going to saute them. Oh. I feel like the fancy restaurant maybe or something. I guess. It's, we're just going to make them so that they aren't hard when you bite them. Okay, so those will go in there. We're going to turn it down to about medium heat, and then I'm going to cover them. Let them saute a little bit. Well, that's working. We're going to cut half of our onion. So what I'm going to do is cut this in half first. I'm not going to turn on the 
Okay? Turn it down a little bit. And then um, you cut it in half. To get the peel off, I put a little slit in the, the peel. And then it will come back. You want to take one or two layers off of your onion. This end off as well. All right, and now we're just going to cut up some strips of onions, just like we did with the pepper. Okay, so just tiny little bits. Actually, a quarter of an onion is probably enough. I would use the bigger knife. My bigger knife isn't very sharp. You have to sharpen that. I think it's way sharp. Needs to be sharpened a little bit. Why don't you grab another sharp knife and just do this and then it gets sharper? I don't know. All right, we'll do the half of the onion. Gives it some good flavor. All right, Rachel, do you want to add the onion in or no? Uh, yeah, as long as the smell that you get. The smell? Yeah. Of onion? Yeah, it gets Your it. eyes watering? Yeah. Usually that happens. Okay, so just about half of an onion chopped, just kind of coarsely. It's going to cook down in here with the peppers. All right, so we're going to let our onions and peppers saute our pasta boil, and then we will join you back here in a second. Okay, so our peppers and onions are nice and sauteed, nice and soft. This has cooked for about three to five minutes or so, covered. That's about all it needs. Okay, so now right, we're going to add our sausage back into our pepper mixture. Okay, so see, it's collected a lot of that fat that we don't want to eat, right? Yeah, that's why we do that. All right, so we're going to stir those together and we're going to add in our pasta sauce. Oh, that's a big chunk. Why do you add the whole thing? <laughs> We're going to stir in our pasta sauce. And while well, that is cooking down a little bit, we're going to check our pasta. It should be about done. It's been in there for eight or nine minutes or so. If you want to check your pasta, just take a spoon with one noodle. Make sure you drain the water out of the noodle before you put it in your mouth. Kind of blow on it a little bit. Make sure there's no water on the inside to burn your mouth. And then test it. it. Should be just a little bit hard to the bite, but, but still pretty soft. So we're going to drain our water in the sink. So after you drain your water, you drain your noodles into a colander. You can bring that back to the um, stove. Continue stirring your sauce, your peppers, and your sausage all up. And then our last step is going to be to add this sauce mixture into your pot of pasta. And that's all there is to sausage pepper pasta. Thanks for joining us on day eight of Cooking with Mrs. Carlson.